Hello, welcome back to Youth and Experience Gaming. We are playing Dad Quest. We are a dad. This is our weapon of choice. Child. We lob it at pineapples. We go on a quest. Uh, hopefully you've got the gist of it by now. If you haven't, you've chosen a weird point to sort of jump in. Oh god damn, Rhino. No, I need my child. Son, come to me. Take oh. Sod off. Ow. I thought you should make it more powerful. I have to charge, child. But it doesn't matter a darn thing if I can't aim properly. No good. Can I oh. just sort of... Yeah, take that. I need to find health desperately. Where am I going? Deeds! Excuse me. Is that I don't like it. No, I was thinking that was the right point. It's got three eyes and wings. Oh, it's dead. Ah, uh, thing. Thank God for that. I'm going to save the game here, just in case. Destroy a child. A person bouncing up and down on the spot. One of those round four egg bunts ate my pet a bunt. I thought it was a type of cake. I swear a bunt cake is one of those ring shaped cakes. Oh, yeah. I swear <laughs> that's what a bunt is. This is my best friend. I tried so hard to get him back, but their poison skin keeps hurting me if I get too close. Please, please help me. I'm not a dad, I don't have anything to fight them with. Luckily I do. Child. So take on the bunts and rescue the pet. How do I get up there? Oh Jesus. No, 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 no. Call for child. This is a hell of a lot of nope. I do Jesus. Go go away. I don't like that. Uh... Yay. There we go. Um, oh, we, we're not engaging in much conversation at this point. I'm just wondering what's going on. I'm just wondering what got them. Yeah. I've been confused in the old age. This is a bit of a departure from like the episode immediately prior to this one, where we're just sort of having a nuanced discussion about education in the modern world and I was just and the boom and what's weird is that was before the break that we're now back from having had a break <laughs> and we've got worse diction than we had before we went to stop well you pet rock loves you unconditionally Ah, that must be the precious pet. We How would a rock exactly put conditions of work into a relationship? <laughs> we got your pet. It's... Did you get my pet back? I could give him a sweaty backhand. Pet rock. Bert, is that really you? You saved Bert. Thank you so much. All I have is this key. Take it. I don't need it. I'm done exploring. Bert and I are going home. Door key. Opens the door. Wow. Oh, oh. Thank you for that explanation. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Mm, uh, tiny pineapples. 
just gonna walk along with a Run away. fully charged child just in case. Oops. Yay. Through here. Save the statue of the floating angel baby. Uh, uh, excuse me. And with a bit of oomph, push that down there, and we go up here. And Bob, what's this? It is a dirt ball. <coughs> well, it's dirt. I forgot my child. I would have carried on for quite a distance then and not noticed I didn't have child under my arm. There's been a lot of um, incidences of people sort of going into shops forgetting their child and leaving them there. Well, you mean like that prominent politician who left his son behind in a pub? Really? Yes. It, he may have been. He may have been a member of uh, the Flon Flervative Party. Um, right. Possibly has a name that sounds a bit like Pavid Bamram. Um, and he may have left his son behind in a pub after spending some time there and deciding, right, I'm off home. Getting a distance and then remembering, hang on, I didn't go to the pub alone. Whoops! <laughs> Advantage. Oh, is your name like a pun on Advantage? Advantage isn't really my dad given name. Is that so? Ed is my real first name, but Vantage was the surname I come up with myself. An alias, if you will. Uh huh. I'll go on. Uh huh. All started when I was hired as the Burbs Desert Watch. I regret letting this man explain his name to me. I didn't think he was going to have this entire backstory. I thought it was just going to be a pun. Oh god. Let me tell you, it wasn't easy at first to start off down below, but I kept getting distracted by eggs. So I had the idea to climb up here to get a better vantage point. So when it hit me, my vantage point was my advantage. Here it comes. Vantage, advantage, Ed. It all made sense. That's why my name is Ed Vantage. Thanks. Anyway, back to watching. Be careful out there. Joy. My life is now complete. It is that rule of puns that we love to tell them but we hate to hear them. No. We've found that out many times on this quest that we've gone on. <laughs> uh, I went with my friend Hannah to um, Bidolf Grange Gardens, which is like a posh. Yeah, I know Bidolf Grange. Yeah. I used to live around there. And oh my god, I don't know what it was with me that day, but so many things that I saw that day just inspired puns in me. To like the point where I saw Hannah go through this complex range of reactions from like, <laughs> oh, you're terrible, to, oh god, you're terrible, to, oh, fuck off, <laughs> to the point where I just kept going and she just gave up reacting altogether. I had, I had destroyed her soul by the end of that day. <sighs> she had sat through like, Pandemonium. <laughs> I think it was, how long were we there? Four or five hours? But like, a pun every ten minutes because there was just always something I could see. And my brain was like, aha, you could say this. Alright, I'm going to say it. And yeah, I just, I slowly killed Hannah. And that was her birthday present. It was like she wanted to go out somewhere so we went to <laughs> Bidolf Grange Gardens. <laughs> And I inflicted that upon her. <laughs> so, so I'm for making you go to a garden. <laughs> it, it was a very nice place to look around. <laughs> Cookies and dirt balls. A man with a serious pink afro. Take a look at my stuff. Take a look at my junk. <laughs> you guys want to see something weird? Ooh, look at the Carpets match the drapes, that's what I'm saying. 
Oh, very bad. <laughs> Looks like. <laughs> I can't say it, I want to, but I can't stop laughing. It looks like... <laughs> this is not going to be worth it by the time it's you not, get there. It's not going to be worth it. No. But the idea that you've got pink hair is just going to look like a cooked sausage in a candy plot. <laughs> <laughs> you got okay. most of that out, the cooked sausage in a candy plot. Machine. Oh, right. Someone dropped a cooked sausage at the candy floss. machine. That's what it would look like if it's. Oh. Well, given that the Americans have the same word for a hot dog sausage and a gentleman sausage, a wiener and a candy floss machine. Yeah. And it could go either way. <laughs> Want to buy a cookie? <laughs> yeah, sure. Why not? Cookie. Uh, heals hearts, which is good, because how many do we have? Eat cookie. How do I eat cookie? Cookie! We haven't got a lot of heart left. Yeah, that's why I'm trying to eat the cookie, but I don't know how to eat the cookie. Right, so there's a heart thing there. You can just go and oh, get I'll it. just go get that. Child! Bam! save continually as we go along because I have mm. no idea as what? to the difficulty curve that we're going to experience mm. with this. Mm -hmm. Oh, dirt ball. And she's a dirt. big thing. Oh, it is a flying testicle and it is angry. It also looks like it's wearing glasses. Or some, some, kind of or some sort of aviator goggles. It seems to poo orange egg because it's all fizzy at the bottom. So it is... <laughs> It's a flying. It is a flying sack. testicle with aviator goggles that pisses orangeade. What are the enemy designs in this game? I mean, what I will say is like it follows that um, unspoken rule of enemy design in games, which 12. is like, right. Okay. It's Tiny hit as it goes down, down by one. Yeah, I'm using the dirt ball power up, so presumably I activate whatever dirt ball does. Uh. But, um. Wow, that's killed a lot of your room. Um, mm. health. How do I use the cookie? I want to eat cookies. Although I'm British, so I should say I want to eat biscuits. Ah, there we go. That's how you do it. What do you have to say? Um, what was I going to say earlier? You're there, About man. the testicles. Um, People don't like it if you scratch them in public. Or in your case, mid-conversation. Strand the itch, the itch. What can you do? <laughs> <laughs> like I said to the Queen. <laughs> Mom, it's just the thing. I dub these, sir. Uh, sh 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 sh. <laughs> I dub these, sir. Uh, leave your fucking junk alone. <laughs> <laughs> that would be a weird one. But, um, the enemy design. It does follow that rule of, like, keep your enemy design consistent. Like, all, all your enemies should look like they should come from the same game. Oh. Um, but that said, what are the enemies? I escort the meteorologist. Presumably that means don't let him get hit with orange aid. Oh, I've yeah. been slain! <laughs> so have I. We're, we're both dead. This is a sad time for everybody. What happens? Oh, I go back here. I need more cookies, I think. No, you've, got, you've got four. Again. Yeah, but if I buy more, I've got more cookies to fight with. Mm -hmm. More cookies. Yes. Still got what? Four. I, oh, oh, okay. You don't keep them in the same slot. 
Oh, no, mm -hmm. got two, lots of two, two sets of four cookies. It, it, they come in those little paper bags you get in like Asda and Sainsbury. And they come in bags of four. Oh, okay. One bag each. Um, we'll try that again. We'll, we'll take on the desert full of testicle monsters in the next episode of Dad Quest. Ah, pause that for now. Um, thank you for watching. Please like if you enjoyed this. Consider subscribing to our channel. Don't forget to hit the bell icon if you do. That way you'll get live updates as to when our videos come out. And don't scratch your balls if you're talking to the Queen. Yeah, don't scratch your balls if you're talking to the Queen. Or, in, like or talking to anyone, really. There's no... <laughs> the only conversation I can see you scratching your balls in the middle of and then not having an adverse reaction to it is telling your GP that your balls are constantly itching and then just... I don't know, if you... Your mates don't tend to mind too much as long as you don't sniff your fingers after. Well, I, I would tell my friends to stop scratching their balls if they started doing that in conversation with me. I'm sorry, I'm that friend. <laughs> Wonderful. And on that somewhat sour note... <laughs> It, you know what you, you're all oh. playing you're all playing pool and then you've all got to share the cue stick and one of your mates has just had a good route around in this back passage and then goes to grab the cue and just don't touch go wash your hands i saw what you just did oh you're one of them are you want the hand wash police <laughs> given the line of work i'm in i kind of need to be pedantic about that sort of thing you work with poo all day. Yeah, which is why I need to be pedantic about that sort of thing. I don't need to traipse it back and forth. Well, there is that, yeah. Yeah. A house full of other people. No. Um, interesting note to go over. Uh, thank you for watching. I, I really wonder if anyone from work watches these videos and what they must think of me. I give the impression I'm so professional. <laughs> it all comes down. You'll know if somebody at work watches one of these videos because they'll punch you as soon as they see you. Because <laughs> it'll come in with a little letter with my P45 saying, nice vid. And here you go. Why do I need the. Oh. 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 Right, um, thank you for watching. I, I work in engineering, so nobody gives a shit as long as you don't bleed on anything. I'm all right. <laughs> well, I've been trying to say goodbye for like the past three minutes now, I think, or something. Anyway, thank you for watching. Like, subscribe, comment. I haven't been telling you to comment in this series. Please comment. Give us comments. We like those. Facebook, engage with us there or in the comment section below this video. Subscribe, share, bye. See you next time. All good stuff. Stop. <laughs>